Daytona Beach, Florida is home to Hangster's Hot Rods Muscle Car and Collector Car Showroom, where we own all the vehicles in our inventory. We are not a consignment dealer. If you're watching this presentation today on YouTube, please be sure to check out our website, hangsters.com. It's where you can find all of our most current inventory. We leave our YouTube videos up at all times on our YouTube channel. We have thousands of subscribers that like to watch our video content. However, when a vehicle is funded in full, it comes down off of our website, letting you know that particular unit is no longer available. Check us out on Instagram as well. We have a gift shop here in Daytona Beach where we have Hangsters Apparel. Hats and t-shirts, uh, we have other garage related type items, flags, banners, signs, um, all kinds of cool stuff and we ship it all over the US. Also, we're gonna have new arrivals such as this one posted on our Instagram. That way if there's a particular year, make or model you might be interested in, you can possibly get a uh, jump on the car or truck or SUV uh, from another prospective buyer by, by checking it out on Instagram and maybe calling in, texting in, getting some uh, additional photos and information. We're gonna try this car. Uh, this is a trade-in we took. This is not something we bought. Uh, 2004 Chevrolet Monte Carlo, uh, 3.8 liter V6, uh, supercharged motor. Uh, you have power steering, power brakes, and of course, air conditioning. This is a car, uh, this will probably be, not probably be, this will be the least expensive car in our inventory. We're gonna take you around and show it to you real quick. I said it is an 04, um, it's all original, everything uh, here. So let's, let's take you around it. Uh, overall paint condition on the hood, pretty good there. I don't even see anything like in the front that's uh, chipped or scratched or anything like that. Uh, does have radial tires, uh, Continental. Uh, Five-star uh, Chevy wheels with your bow tie emblem in the center. Uh, this is the Dale Earnhardt Intimidator uh, SS model, so we'll show you some of the uh, characteristics of that particular package. Uh, you have a huge front windshield here. It's uh, in good shape. I don't see anything that's uh, cracked or chipped. Does have a sunroof up top there. Uh, I would imagine that it's power. We'll check that out when we are on the uh, test drive. We'll see if that works. Um, you know, this isn't like presenting a, uh, you know, 1960 uh, vehicle. This is, you know, a 2004, so your door fitment's obviously pretty good. You can see that on the uh, driver's side there. Your ground effects there down low uh, underneath the rocker uh, is in, you know, good shape for as low as it sits. Uh, the Intimidator badging there on the uh, rear quarter and the uh, double SS there in red. Uh, again, this was the Intimidator package. This was a factory package from General Motors back in 2004. Taking a look in the interior, um, power windows, power door locks here on the uh, door. Again, we'll show you in a test drive if those things are uh, functioning at this time or not. Uh, power mirrors as well, so driver and passenger power mirrors. Uh, I do have the uh, Dale Earnhardt logo there embroidered in the headrest, both driver and passenger. Um, overall interior condition looks to be pretty good. Uh, obviously, the driver's seat here has some wear on it. It, it is leather, you know, getting in and out of the uh, vehicle, um, you know, driver's side, obviously, uh, you know, taking on some wear there. Um, does have uh, factory floor mats and uh, aftermarket floor mats. So the uh, carpeting is in pretty good shape underneath the floor mat. The uh, Factory floor mats in excellent condition, and then you have a uh, rubber uh, Chevy floor mat on top of that. I did mention you do have a sunroof up there in the headliner. Uh, it's got that pullback shade, window shade there. So we'll again see if that uh, sunroof functions when we're on the test drive. Uh, power seats it does work. Uh, let's see if I can manage to get in the back seat here. Uh, you do have uh, seat belts in the back and then the little fold down armrest in the back center there. Dome light illuminates when you open up the uh, door just like it should. Of course front and rear seat belts. Uh, the overall paint condition on the car is really really quite nice. Uh, I don't see anything that I really need to point out. Well here there's a little spot there on the uh, driver door handle right there. A little tiny chip um, out of the uh, door. But uh, other than that, I don't see anything really on the driver's side that's 
you know, would need to be addressed or is a, is a problem. Rear window defrost. Two speakers there in the uh, hat rack in the back behind the rear seats. Car does have a rear spoiler on it. Uh, deck lid fitment to the rear quarters, you know, flawless. <laughs> Good there. It is the original trunk and the original quarters. So, uh, The uh, bow tie emblem in the center. Again, you have your Intimidator SS package there on the deck lid on the passenger side. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. There's a Monte Carlo uh, badging there on the driver's side of the deck lid. There is a scratch in the deck lid right above the uh, Monte Carlo logo there. Do you have your reverse lights down low there in the lower fascia? And then your uh, factory dual exhaust there coming out of the lower fascia as well. Take a look in the trunk. Carpeting. Do have a uh, spare there, a donut, not a full size spare. It's like a donut spare underneath the uh, trunk area there. When you do uh, pop the trunk, you do have a trunk light that comes on. Uh, deck lid shocks are good. Your trunk seal's good there. By the way, uh, the car, 100,000 miles on the car. Uh, we will take a look at the odometer when we are in the test drive again. We do have still photos on our website of all four wheels, so you can see if the wheels have any, um, you know, rust or flaking or oxidization of the uh, material there on the wheels. Uh, they all look to be in pretty good shape uh, from where I'm standing. Um, all four wheels look to be uh, in pretty good condition. The rear quarter on the uh, passenger side there is about the same as the driver's in pretty good shape. I don't see any uh, serious paint defects or flaws there. Uh, again, the Intimidator logoing and the SS badging that is factory. Uh, do have a couple scuffs, you know, on your lower, uh, that sits real low to the ground, obviously, your ground effects there on the uh, lower portion of the rocker panel, so a couple chips and scratches, but overall, uh, you know, really nice shape, uh, you know, for a 2004, uh, really well taken care of, really well cared for. Check out the uh, passenger side, same as the driver's side, door panel's in good condition, uh, bucket seat there on the passenger side's in good shape. Your dash pad's all in good condition. You have your Dale Earnhardt logo there again on the uh, passenger side headrest, the same as it was on the driver's side. So, good shape. Uh, your front fender on the uh, passenger side, same as the driver's side. The uh, paint's nice. I don't see anything, you know, there's nothing blistering down low or anything. There's no fading of the clear. Uh, it's in uh, real nice condition. Uh, you have your Monte Carlo crest there up in the center of the uh, front fascia on the nose of the car. Uh, clarity of the headlights is pretty, pretty good on driver and passenger side. Uh, dual mirrors that are painted the same black as the vehicle. Again, I, we mentioned those are power. We'll check uh, those out and see if they work here when we're on our test drive. This was just a real quick, quick presentation of our 04 Monte Carlo. We are going to take it around the building. We'll check out the undercarriage here in just a couple minutes, and then we will drive it shortly after that. And you can do all the above when you visit our showroom here in Daytona. When you're buying a classic vehicle from us, we encourage you to come in person. This way you can check out the paint quality for yourself. You can check out the undercarriage of the vehicle for yourself. We'll let you drive it. You can see the engine performance, transmission performance. You can uh, feel how the vehicle uh, handles, drives, performs, what kind of horsepower is putting out, all that uh, stuff. We show a number of people uh, week in and week out, not only our entire business operation, but our, our, our cars, our inventory, people fly in, test drive them, drive up from Southern Florida, drive from the other coast. We sell a lot of cars on the uh, west coast of Florida over in the Sarasota area, Bradenton. But uh, <clears throat> we do most of our business sight unseen. Um, people buy off of our photos on our website. 
They buy off of these video presentations you're watching, and they buy off of the spec sheets that we do for our website, which you know give you tire size, gear ratio, uh, whether it's a numbers matching motor or not. This one, by the way, is. Uh, so we've been doing sight unseen business for over 20 years. Hopefully that tells you a little something about our business model. We try to represent each one of our vehicles as honestly and as accurately as we possibly can. We've got customers from all over the United States and all over the globe, as a matter of fact, that are, you know, are multiple car buyers from us. Uh, they're collectors, uh, hobbyists, enthusiasts, whatever, or like to switch out their classic cars 12 to 18 months, you know, and um, we, we do a lot of business, repetitive business, first time business, and we've been doing this a long time and it's what we enjoy doing. But again, we encourage you guys to visit in person, especially if this is your first classic car purchase. My um, opinion of what a classic car should look like, sound like, drive like, present like, may not be the same as yours. So this is why we encourage you to visit us here in Daytona Beach. We have a beautiful facility. All of our cars are indoors, air conditioned. We don't keep anything outside. We'd love to have you in and uh, show you any car that you might be interested in. Let's take this 04 Monte Carlo around the building. We will see what rack we have uh, available back there. We'll check out the undercarriage and then shortly after that, we will take it on the test drive. Underneath our 04 Monte Carlo, you have disc brakes up front. You can see uh, oil pan and training pan are dry. Both of them are uh, visible and you can see them and they are dry, which is cool. Uh, cross members in good shape here. You know, your uh, engine cradle area, all of that's in good condition. Moving back, uh, you have your uh, exhaust system going down the uh, center of the vehicle between the floor pans. Uh, floor pans on the driver's side and the passenger side are in fantastic condition. Gas tank's in good shape. Plastic, plastic gas tank. Again, all your uh, exhaust system looks to be in good condition. I don't see any uh, rust holes, rod holes, pin holes, anything like that. Dual mufflers. We showed you in the showroom the uh, exhaust pipes coming out below the lower fascia, and you can see the uh, nice big mufflers on either side, driver and passenger side. There's your little donut spare. Trunk pan looks good. No rust or rot there. Got a uh, good tire life left, good tread left. Uh, it's not dry rotted, cracking. Uh, got a quite a little bit of distance there before the wear bars. Nice looking 04 Monte Carlo. Uh, we do not have financing options available on this vehicle simply because it is not uh, old enough and not uh, expensive enough. So uh, we do have Lightstream that we do work with uh, that will lend on this vehicle if you have good credit. Uh, they will give you a loan. It's an, kind of like, it's not a, a typical auto loan. It's just like a, a, an unsecured loan that they offer. So if that's an option. Otherwise, you can use, you know, your own bank or credit union. If you're a cash buyer, we accept cash. Uh, you can bring us cash if you're coming in person. We also accept a certified bank check from your bank. And then, of course, bank wire transfer is the most common form of payment when you're buying something sight unseen because uh, it's there the same day and we can start processing the vehicle for shipment that much quicker. Once the vehicle is funded in full, it goes into a pre-delivery inspection process. This process is recorded and you get a copy of it on the keychain when the car arrives. Along with all of the photos that we took of the vehicle in the showroom and this video presentation you're watching right now. So you have that little keepsake on the keychain. If we're shipping the car, once the guys tell me it's through inspection and it's good to go, we call for a carrier for pickup and it's on its way to you wherever you might be in the United States or in the world for that matter. And of course, if you are local to us here in Daytona or Central Florida or you're picking it up yourself, maybe you're driving in, flying in, driving it home, uh, we'll let you know when it's ready and you can come get it. Let's set this 04 Monty down on the ground. We'll take it out. It's a beautiful day here in Central Florida. We'll take it out and uh, show you guys how it runs out. Inside of our 04 Monte Carlo, where do we want to start? A lot of stuff. Door locks, power. Window. Driver. Passenger. I'm not going to go all the way up and down for you guys. Bore you with that. Um, how about wipers? Turn signals. Driver and passenger. Tack, 
100,574 is the mileage right below the Dale Earnhardt signature there or the Dale Earnhardt package. Temp works, oil pressure, got a boost gauge there for the turbo and of course fuel. Radio functions. Um, look at this, heated seats. It's 80 degrees today, so I'm not going to figure out if those work. <laughs> I don't need them today, I can assure you that. Um, let's see, what do we got? AC. There's the little snowflake that's lit there. Uh, uh, let's see, where is the fan control? Oh, that's the fan control. And it's blown cold. We'll leave that on low. Um, what else? Showed you the radio. Showed you. Oh, it's probably tilt wheel. Uh, mirrors. Drivers works. Passengers works. Sunroof works. Power. Hmm, is that it? I think it is. Let's take it on a little drive here. Oh, look, a tape deck. That's funny. Looks like there's a tape jammed in there. Eject. Tape deck doesn't work. It's okay, there's no tapes in existence anymore anyway. Let's take it on drive. Our 04 Monty runs good. Uh, doesn't have any tire vibration or drivetrain vibration whatsoever. Um, all of our gauges are functioning properly. Temps coming up. Speedometer's working. Tax working. There's no uh, check engine lights on. There's no tire pressure lights on. Car tracks nice and straight. Going down the road. Has good acceleration. Take it up through the gears here in just a little bit. Again, it's a V6. Uh, no pulsation or vibration in the brakes. Car idles real nicely. Oh, got some traffic. Oh, they got their turn signal. Okay. Well, see that 70? I'm catching up to Mr. Jeep. But the car has a lot of good pickup out of a V6. Pretty nice vehicle. No vibration in the steering wheel. Front end alignment's good. Nice and expensive car. You use this thing as a daily driver. The Monte Carlos are extremely hot right now. Uh, you know, the 70s and the 80s Monte Carlos. I don't know, we haven't had any of this particular body style through our showroom, so I don't know what kind of uh, activity we'll get on it. I imagine quite a bit, seeing as how it's going to be a nice, inexpensive, uh, well-maintained car. Um, so I don't imagine it'll be on our uh, website very long. 386-944-9219 is our contact phone number here in Daytona Beach. Hangsters.com is our website. You'll be able to see all the photos of this vehicle there, as well as this video presentation you're watching right now. Generally at full retail price, our cars include shipping in the lower 48 United States and a 12 month, 12,000 mile powertrain warranty. This car includes neither one. Um, it's going to be offered at a very inexpensive price point. We're not getting rich off the car we're making a couple bucks and we're moving on to the next one like i said it's just a trade-in vehicle um, it's not a classic car muscle car um, so we're just putting it up for sale we uh, can certainly help you uh, get shipping arrangements taken care of if you're you know in ohio or pa or new york or texas and you want this car shipped to you we can put you in touch with a carrier that will uh, you know handle the transport for you if you have your own transporter, that's fine. If you'd like to fly in to Daytona or Orlando and come see us in person and drive it home, that's fine as well. But uh, no shipping, no warranty included in this particular transaction. So, 
It's a pretty nice car. Again, you know, this would make a nice car for like, you know, somebody out there. Maybe you're a, a, a bow tie person, a Chevy person, uh, and you have a, a young kid um, that's, you know, might be in high school or something. This would be a real nice, uh, good-looking, inexpensive car for them to, uh, you know, and a reliable car. So, enough listening to me talk. Like I said, I don't think this car will last very long given the price point and the quality and, you know, how well the car's been cared for. So, again, reach out to us at Hangsters Hot Rods. We are located in Daytona Beach, Florida. You can visit our website, which is hangsters.com. You can text us. You can make an offer. You can um, send an inquiry, send an email, and we'll get back to you just as soon as we possibly can. We'd love to earn your business, so please check us out.